Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna see a new Paula Young young lady. Her name is Natalia, and this is her in a brand new color. So stay tuned. Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm Coco and this is Coco's Hair Solutions. Today I'm going to be looking at a new wig to Paula Young. Her name is Natalia and she is in a new color. It's called Sunlit Sable, I think. Oh, let me double tap. <laughs> Sunlit Sable, yes. 4 slash 16 S6. And she looks to be like a really beautiful blend of light browns and blonde highlights which is right up my alley. Well, every wig is right up my alley. <laughs> so here she is in the box. <laughs> oh gosh. I hope you don't have that problem, but this is there. <laughs> Here's her numbers. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Well, let's get her out of the box and look at her. <laughs> okay. So she is very blonde. Whoa. Look at all these curls. My goodness. Look at this. Yep. Yeah. Beautiful. Lots and lots of uh, little individual curls all the way around down to the back. Let's take a closer look at the picture in the magazine. So we've got this picture here of the front and there's a picture of the back. Well, let's take a look at her cap construction already. She feels very light and it, no wonder she's got an open cap construction. She does have some closed lace right here on the crown and coming down the middle to the front wide band of velveteen to go across the hairline, but she's open wefted on the right and left on this on the top. So that's gonna give you a lot more breathability, a little light, lightness, um, maybe even a little bit of stretching there. So a little bit more comfort. And then of course, we have the open ear tabs with fiber stitched on the bottom side. We have Velcro closures on the right and left of the nape, and it's an extended closed nape. See that? Okay. And then lots of wefts all the way around. So that should be really nice. Oh, she's pretty. Looks like she's got a little bit of a longer bang right here too. So now to think about how am I going to, I don't think I'll disrupt these curls to begin with. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to take my brush and I'm just gonna kind of comb the very top of the part where the zigzag part was at, okay? That's gonna lift up the hairs, make it a little more realistic and it won't look quite so boxy. And um, we'll go ahead and put her on then and see what that looks like. Okay, what I have on right now is a wig from The Wig Company. Her name is Make Waves, and I did a review on her before. She's a great wig, so look her up in my videos, all right? So let's go ahead and try on this young lady here. This is Natalia, okay. Okay, the cap feels very nice. Oh, look at this. Whoa, it's been a long time since I saw myself in curls this long. <laughs> long time, okay. Well, let's look at this. The hairline doesn't look too bad. And it looks like, wow. Okay, so the picture, they have her looking much smoother around the face and the top and the crown down to the sides. So maybe, maybe that's what we want to strive for. Almost looks like Gail though, doesn't it? Almost, with the, the bangs. Well, let's, let's go back to Natalia. That's a new style. Yeah, these curls, these curls look quite a bit different than these curls. These look more like body, a little bit more body than it does curls. But let's see. Wow, I feel, uh, I feel kind of racy in this. <laughs> okay, let's see. She's got a far part on the, on the left. So she's got, she comes from the left over to the right with the part. So let's see how that works. And the bangs come down across. Yeah, these bangs have a lot more curl in them than the, the picture, the picture. That doesn't mean it's bad. It just means it's different, right? Different is not bad or good. It's just different. We're gonna let it be different. 
Okay. Well, wow. This is, this is kind of fun in a way. Now, if I can get these guys to lay down the way I want them to. Now, because they cover me, let's see, they cover my, my bio hair about average, but I would definitely have to treat, treat my, my um, grow out with a, a root cover up because this is uh, pulling away a little bit because the curls are pulling them back away from, from the edge of my, my hairline. So that would have to be fixed. And that, that is an easy fix. That's a real easy fix. But with all this curl, I think it gets in the way of expecting that the side bang is gonna sweep down over here to the cheek area and have it be nice and smooth. So we can see there's a lot more curl in here. But again, it doesn't mean that it's bad. It just means it's different. So what would it be like if I cut bangs into this young lady? She would look a little bit more like some other hairstyles in the magazine. Um, we could take advantage of these curls a little bit better. Okay. And let's see if I want to fluff this out a little bit more from the underside to preserve the individual curls, then that might not be bad. Let's do it. Let me do a spin for you. This is a really curly girl, isn't it? And I know it's the right box. It's Natalia. Yeah, Natalia. I was worried I got the wrong box. <laughs> I'm talking about the wrong, wrong, wrong wig. Natalia. Yeah, that's, that's her. Yep. New style, new color. Okay. Well, let's check. Let's look at the dimensions. Okay. Alrighty. So she's 4.8 ounces. She is, um, seven inches in the front. She's got a 10 and a half inch top and crown. So this top part is 10 and a half. This part is 10 and a half. And then we have 11 and a half inches sides, the sides. Okay. Maybe that's this, that's gotta be this one. And the upper back is 11 and a half inches. The nape is 10 inches. So see how far down that goes? 10 inches down the middle of my back. Almost, yeah, almost to the middle. Okay, so there you go. She comes in 22 colors. And um, plus this exclusive color of Sunlit Sable, which I think is very pretty. I think it's a very auburnish. I have some red undertones and uh, lots of gold and blonde in it. Lots of gold and blonde. But that's that's kind of fun, isn't it? Doesn't doesn't look too bad. But okay, so that that's where playing with these bangs, we would want to trim those bangs a little bit. And of course, we could use all kinds of clips to pull her back and do all kinds of fun stuff. I could actually get my headband and hold some of this back. That would look cute, wouldn't it? Yeah, with that. Okay, and then of course we've got our clips. We could use our clips to pull our hair back a little bit more, right? Oh my gosh, and we could definitely, we could definitely pull this up and leave tendrils all the way around, couldn't we? That would look okay. Let's try that. Well, you could see how that would work if it was done right. <laughs> but look at this. This is really kind of cute, isn't it? I've never really considered myself a real curly girl, but I'm getting to like some of these styles. They're kind of fun. And of course, a little bit longer in length. Who says that I can't wear long hair? Not you guys. <laughs> anyway, so we can play with all kinds of things. And you could even use scrunchies. 
but I kind of like the messy look, don't you? Yeah, it would be kind of fun to have just wavy curly hair just for fun. Well, this is Natalia. At least this is the Natalia I got. I don't think she looks quite like the book. And, um, cause she looks shorter in this one than this, this does and less curly. Doesn't she look like that to you? But here again, I'm, um, not sure if you're hoping to get this style that you'll get her, but at least you'll have this color. You know, this color is, is different. This is a brand new color. So maybe that's something worth looking at. And maybe if we brush her completely out, some of those waves will settle down and um, might be looking pretty good, huh? Okay, well, I kind of like this actually. I might go see what my husband says. Now, <laughs> I'll give you a report, okay? Alrighty. Well, thanks so much to, <laughs> thanks. Thank you so much for joining me today. This was kind of fun. It was a an eye opener and something different, um, but it's still fun, isn't it? So something brand new from Polly Young, something brand new, something different, and it looked great. So we will see you next time in Paula, in Paula. We'll, we'll see you next time in Coco's Hair Solutions, okay? Be there or be square. Bye-bye. <laughs>